From Tampa Bay Streaming News Source, brought to you by AlertTodayFlorida.com, this is ABC Action News. Hello, I'm Wendy Ryan. Dennis has Florida's most accurate forecast in just a moment. But first, here are your ABC Action News Now headlines. Tampa police making two arrests for that deadly hit and run accident over the weekend. 80 year old Felix de la Uz was hit by a car that went off the road on West Hillsboro Avenue. He died after pushing his wife out of the way. Police say the driver, Tracy Wood, did not have a license. Wood and the woman in the car with him during the time of the accident were found camping out in Pasco County. The man believed to be responsible for a series of deadly bombings in Austin left a 25 minute recording. Police revealing late tonight they will now take that as Mark Condit's confession. Early this morning, Condit blew himself up as police were closing in on him. Newly released video showing the moments leading up to a deadly crash involving a self-driving Uber in Tempe, Arizona. The video does not show the moment of impact. The woman was hit Sunday night. It's the first death involving a fully autonomous test vehicle and now Uber is suspending its involvement with self-driving cars. In other news, the man who Tampa police believe stole $20,000 in the armed robbery of the Seminole Hard Rock Casino is now in custody. 24 year old Dirk Davis was found today in Georgia and in Manatee County. Officials are now revealing a service which allows people to text 911. It could be beneficial in active shooting situations. Now here's Dennis with your forecast Den. Hey, Wendy, temperatures are going to be downright chilly tomorrow morning. So again, you'll be waking up mostly in the 40s and 50s. The kids are going to need the jacket, the sweater. The sweatshirt as anywhere from Pinellas and Hillsborough County will be 40s to the lower 50s. Citrus, Hernando and Pasco, you'll be in the upper 30s to low 40s, especially from Brooksville over to Spring Hill, right around that 40 degree mark and a little bit warmer from Bartow down to Arcadia, mid 40s east of I-75, closer to the beach from Bradenton down to Venice in the lower 50s. Lots of sunshine, but then the weekend brings some big change. And of course, we'll be on that over the next couple of days. All right, thanks, Dan. And don't forget, you can get news updates all day long on your favorite streaming device. And remember to download our free ABC Action News app. This ABC Action News Brief was brought to you by AlertFloridaToday.com. Drivers always avoid distractions while driving and focus on the road because safety doesn't happen by accident.